The other uh, big one there uh, was was Dell. So uh, Dell actually had one of the keynotes on Thursday, uh, Dario Zamarian, mm -hmm. um, who is the, the new kind of czar general manager of the networking space. And I got to sit down with him, which was really quite interesting. Because if you think from a networking standpoint, you know, well, how does Dell really fit into that picture? Um, and I asked him that question, and, and uh, he was very kind of frank and honest in saying, you know, I, I asked that same thing when I interviewed. Dell is not, you know, they have uh, their own kind of low consumer end uh, product line, but mostly they're doing things through partnering. So uh, their big partners are Juniper, Brocade, and Aruba Networks on the wireless side. And uh, he said really his job is to uh, give Dell some credibility in the space, uh, first working with their partners and eventually growing, uh, you know, of course, probably their services with their Perot acquisition uh, and uh, try, trying to get into that space a little more as they build their converged infrastructures. So we saw well, Dell bought Equalogic, um, tried to buy 3PAR yep. to do the high-end storage play. Uh, you just mentioned the Perot acquisition. Obviously, Dell is transforming itself. Do you see Dell actually acquiring a networking company? So uh, I, I asked him that specifically. And uh, if you look at the options that they have out there, you know, they're not going to buy Juniper. Juniper is just way too big. Too it's, rich. You know, twelve to fifteen billion dollars uh, for that acquisition. Uh, you know, I, they're not going to buy Brocade. It really doesn't make a whole lot of sense. It's also, you know, three to four billion dollars at least uh, from what Brocade's market cap is. Um, he said that if they made an acquisition, uh, it would probably be something on the smaller side, something on the edge. So if you look at what IBM did recently with the Blade Networks BNT acquisition, that was rumored to be somewhere between the three and four hundred million dollar range. Or even look at what Cisco did a few years back uh, with buying. Linksys, which was about a $500 million, million dollar acquisition. So if you look at where Dell plays in the marketplace, they're not going to get a core, you know, switch supplier. They're not going to be competing with the Cisco Nexus 7000 uh, or, or uh, you know, some of the products that Juniper makes at the core. But at the edge, which is a little more defensive, and at the, the line where the server and uh, networking and virtualization all play into space, uh, there, there could be an acquisition or uh, in the consumer space if it made sense.